Hey YouTube, we're back on Granville Street and we're asking people today, how do you handle rejection? This is Vancouver Talks. How do you handle rejection? As a lesson. As a lesson. Yeah, as a lesson. You gotta put yourself out there. If you don't put yourself out there, you're never gonna know. If you don't ask that girl what her name is, what her number is, and she tells you, oh, I have a boyfriend, oh, I'm not interested, you're never gonna know. You gotta put yourself out there. Very How well. do you? Uh, very well. well. Liquor, wait, wait, wait. Don't drugs. Oh, uh, very, very well. well. If a guy doesn't like me, I am in love. <laughs> <laughs> If someone rejects you, then they never the girls could say the you. same. I personally feel like I handle it pretty well, mostly because I always expect it. I will ask for some constructive criticism. Just tell me what I did wrong, and if I can change anything in the future. If I'm madly in love with him, obviously it sucks, but... So take it as a learning experience. Yeah. Oh, don't take it too personal. No, not too personal. How do you handle rejection? When uh, someone rejects you, it could be a girl, yeah. it could be from work, it, it could be whatever. That's Deep like, depression. Yeah, <laughs> a lot of drinking. A lot of drinking. <laughs> don't leave your house. Usually you start smoking cigarettes again. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. Usually no. you get back. Respect you use it for everyone. Yeah. Yeah. Which, there's what? What? That's how you handle oh, rejection. Like, get in here. Get in here. Get in here. How do you handle he's rejection? Irish. He's, he's Irish. He's Irish? Irish, Irish don't get rejected. Don't speak to cameras, he says. How do you handle rejection? I've never been rejected ever. <laughs> <laughs> so I never had to deal with it. So they said. <laughs> <laughs> How do you handle rejection? I don't. That's the problem. <laughs> I just keep. We're Irish or Irish. If you don't go into rejection, you don't need to get rejected. Irish people don't deal with rejection, man. It's they excessive just, alcohol. Well, I'll so, you know? <laughs> come back, man. It's a circle. It's a circle. <laughs> I walk away, honestly. <laughs> when it comes to it, if I ever get rejected, I'm going to be like, you know what? It's okay. I walk away. I don't take it to heart. I'm very comfortable with myself. It happens. It happens to everyone. Yeah. Not everyone's your type. Not everyone's my type. It fucking happens. You fucking walk away. You go to the next one. When a really pretty girl rejects you, do you take a pretty to girl it? rejects me? I'm married. I'm already married. So. Oh, you're married. Oh. Have you been rejected? Oh, for sure. How do you handle it? Do you take it really personal? I go to therapy. <laughs> 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 I think that's adorable. I think that should be a normal answer. I deal with it. I'm healthy. Healthily? Like try you try to deal with it. Yeah. yeah. My, everybody in there. The camera. Yeah. I got like a super everybody. wide lens here. Dude, how do you handle rejection? Rejection is part of life. Well, we don't handle rejection. We don't. we don't get rejected. We don't get rejected. Just settle. Just settle. Have a good night. Rejection is like a flower. You know what I mean? Like I love you. I love you not. So like. <laughs> So like, if you handle rejection well, you just like take it like a grain of salt. Rejection makes you go harder. Makes you go harder, okay. Yeah, you okay. know what I mean? Have you been rejected? <laughs> oh, I've been rejected and I've sent rejection. Do you like being rejected or like sending rejection? I mean, it's never a positive feeling. You don't ever want to reject a person. Like, it's no. never a good feeling to reject mm. someone, right? Like, it's not, it's not, not a, nothing that you ever want to do. I agree, but I feel like I would rather reject somebody than be rejected. You, absolutely. Yeah, that makes sense. Yeah, that absolutely. totally makes sense. It's yeah. a bit sad, absolutely. but. Yeah, yeah, yeah. I mean, I don't know. I'm, I'm always reject, so I mean. <laughs> so, yeah, I don't it's know. part of life, right? Kind of thing. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, yeah. You should ask her. It's a very recent. <laughs> so I got rejected from a second date. Because I went on a first date with a guy. And you liked him? I liked him in the beginning, but after introspection with my best friend, yeah. I feel like he wasn't the one wasn't for me. One yeah. Day. But I feel like second dates are important because sometimes on the first date, people are nervous yeah. and people have a mask on. Yeah. yeah. And oh, once yeah. masks come off, sometimes they come off on the second date. Sometimes it could be the fifth date, you don't know. You get comfortable and then you might, yeah. 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 So how did you take that rejection? Was it how tough? How did I take it? It was hard, but she has a really good therapist. <laughs> <laughs> Your best friend, that's, that makes yeah. sense. I handle it well from other people because then I'm like, oh, that's what you're choosing. I feel like the worst rejection is like the, the negative self-beliefs that you hold. And then like you fuck up your own opportunities. So the ones like, yeah, you screw up yourself. And then you're kind of like, you're like, oh shit, it's my fault. I just move on to the next one. Don't even sweat it. It's just abundance, man. Law of abundance. Uh, not very well. <laughs> like, at all. I'm gonna go cry in my room for about six hours. 
Do, do you guys get rejected? Like, do girls get rejected as much as guys do? Or No, not at all. No, Probably right. not at all. I don't even, like, give myself the opportunity to be rejected. Yeah. Oh. If I know that I'm going to be, like, rejected in any way, I'd be like, no, I'm not going to put myself in that situation. Oh, like, yeah. defend the barrier. Yeah, yeah. Barrier. Yeah, exactly. She don't get it. <laughs> G- girls have it easy sometimes, right? A little yeah. bit. You know, if you're good looking, you're not going to get rejected. Yeah. Have you rejected someone before? Yeah. You must have. Yes. Yeah. Uh, how, is that hard? No. No? <laughs> Just savagely go, no, I don't like you. Go yeah. Ahead. Are you talking about with women? Well, well, overall. Everything. Overall? Not just women, uh, maybe overall in life. Because some people are scared of it. So, okay, here's how it works, actually. So, <laughs> so I'm reading this book. What's I'm good? I'm reading this book. Yeah. It's called. How yeah, do you, introduce yourself. How do you handle rejection? I don't get rejected. <laughs> Aren't you lucky? I know. I knew she'd say that shit. It's just the truth. Yeah, I'm sure. Hey. Uh-huh. You guys how ask how do you guys handle rejection? Um, by being hot. I've never been rejected. Oh, no. never, that's never not, been that's rejected. No, that's not that's true. No, that's no, not true. Um, I have been everyone, rejected. Everyone, I reject. I'm not the rejectee. Fuck, I don't know, man. I'm not already rejected, so I mean, <laughs> at this point, I, I don't really know. He doesn't want to even want to kiss me, so what? Yeah, yeah that's like, rejection. That's, that's rejection and, and right he, there. And he's fine, and he's fine about it. Yeah. He's fine about it. He's chill about it. See? I mean, at this point, like, I want to kiss it too, but like, it's, yeah. it's, 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 it's all good. Yeah. By her on camera. Come on, let's go. No peer pressure. Come on, don't give her peer no pressure. pressure. For the guys that are watching that have issues with handling rejection, what do you tell them? What kind of advice would you give them? I would say it's for the best because the, the right woman would never reject you. She'd be crazy about you, so don't waste your time. That's a bit Focus sad on yourself. Well, it's what? true. I don't know. You watch a lot of love movies. Oh, fuck <laughs> off. That's too sad. Every unasked yes is a no. <laughs> That's a good quote right there. For the viewers that watch this, that have issues handling rejection, what are the steps that you took to get to that level? Just don't dwell on the past. Have like an abundance mindset. There's, there's always going to be a better one. You know, getting consistency is the more times you do it, the easier it is. And eventually, you won't get rejected. And then when you don't get rejected, that's why you're working towards that. And you build self-confidence. Not everyone's your type. Not everyone's your fucking person. You can ask probably 50 year olds and 50 of them are not your type. There's gonna be one of them, you know what I mean? There's gonna be more. There's always more. There's so many fucking people in this world. Someone will be your type. If that one girl that you're looking at is not your type, then so what? Like, who gives a big... Everyone gets rejected. It's a normal thing. It's a, it's a fucking people thing. What are those, like, huge questions, like, elementary school? That fucking sucks That sucks, right? It, it, yeah. it fucking hurts. It fucking hurts. You fucking move on, there's gonna be another fucking girl. They always come back. They always come back. They find an asshole and they always come back to the real ones. <laughs> That's, Literally, uh, deep down if you're truth. kind and honest, they always come back. They always return. Oh, for sure. I'm actually a lesbian. Here's what I say about rejections. If you don't shoot your shot, you'll never know. As hard as it is, it takes a lot of confidence to work yourself up to like give someone a compliment. As hard as that is, sometimes you're gonna get rejected, sometimes you're not. But the confidence it takes, I feel like you should just go with it. And that's like the confidence it takes to do that is just like overwhelmingly awesome regardless. So just be yourself. Put yourself out there. Yeah, put yourself out there and you never know what's gonna happen. Some girls are gonna suck, some girls aren't. But like, you know what? You're never gonna know unless you shoot your shot. Yeah, and you gotta meet like good people and you gotta meet bad people. Exactly. That's just how it is, Exactly. Right? She just took the words out of my mouth. Ah. <laughs> no, you took the words out of my mouth. She's, it's like she planned this whole she, entire interview. I feel like right? she I knew I was gonna it. It's so natural. I knew I was gonna it's so natural. No, it was, it was not no, planned. It was I just it met wasn't. these people. Just no, they people. actually did plan this. <laughs> <laughs> Don't take it personally. Yeah. And I know it's hard because at first I took it personally, but at the end of the day, it's what the other person wants. It's not you. It's not, it's not about and it, you. And you're probably hitting a chord on the other person that's, you know, something different than okay. who you are. Yeah. And not, not everyone's going to, like, fit your... No. Yeah. yeah. Because you may have an idea of what you think it'll be. If you're into something and then you realize, whoa, I really don't want this person. I want the idea of what it is. <laughs> then it could be something totally different and you won't yeah. be into it. Yeah. Makes sense. Makes sense. Yeah. But you got to put yourself out there, right? Of course, yeah, yeah. yeah. Don't stop putting yourself out there, yeah, yeah. is what I would say. Yeah. Just go um, for it, just Yeah, go just for go it. for it, because you never know. Don't be a pussy. Yeah, exactly. Don't be a pussy, that makes, yeah, makes sense. Yeah, yeah. Because you never know the real outcome is going to be, right? So. To be able to handle rejection. <laughs> like, I swear, everyone attracts someone. Yeah. Oh, okay. Everyone attracts someone different. Yeah. 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 There's no one in this world who every, out of these 4.5 billion girls, I'd be like, no. Yeah. Yeah. There's always going to be one. Rejection happens because, let's say, an opportunity. You only align with it when you align with it, like, spiritually. The more you actually put yourself in uncomfortable situations, 
the more it becomes second nature to handle not getting what you want. So it's yeah. kind of like you have to become detached from the outcome and just like stop holding back. The more you hold back, then the less you be yourself. For example, sometimes you're having a conversation with someone and you're like, man, should I ask this question? If you don't ask the question, it's the same thing as being like, oh, I want to travel and then not doing it. If it doesn't manifest, but you wanted it, it stays inside you. So then it's a repressed thing. Do you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah. So it's like you have to put yourself in the energy of following your like intuition and being spontaneous because then you more naturally, you encounter rejection, but then you're like, yo, I don't care because I didn't think. I didn't put feelings in this thing. Okay, I just wait. did it because I felt like saying it or because I felt like doing it. Do you know what I mean? Okay, wait. Even when it comes to girls, it's, I think people who see things as rejection have to change the way they see themselves because if you see yourself as the, the prize, then mm. someone's losing out on an opportunity mm -hmm, mm -hmm. if they don't want to fuck with you or they don't want to like yeah, engage. Engage with you, yeah. And you can't force that stuff, man. No, like, you, you can't. Can. Yeah, yeah. I think one of the things is uh, add value into someone's life. Yeah. Right? Because yeah. you're, you're taking value away from them, and then when they don't give you value back, you, re you get rejected and you don't receive yeah. anything. So you think you're going to receive something, but you didn't receive anything at all. Yeah. And you feel like, oh shit, that sucks. But the thing is, you have to keep going, man. Most people, the way they handle rejection is that they start to identify with the feeling of being rejected yeah. and then it stops them from taking action. I think like the more you identify with taking action, the less you identify with rejection. But if you hardly take action, when you get rejected, you're like, oh, this is what happens every time. Yet there's actually lots of things and opportunities that become available to you when you start taking more action. You know what I mean? Yeah. Makes sense. Yeah, I, I can understand that. There's a, there's a lot to grasp there, right? Yeah, yeah. yeah there's, there's a yeah, lot to grasp there. Yeah, yeah. Like. Thanks for watching. And uh, if you guys want to know how I handle rejection, is uh, I go for like really long walks by myself, thinking about life, you know, all the things that I failed at. Um, show like, subscribe. M Square out. Hey YouTube, today we're back on Granville Street and we're asking people today what the hell is really bad. What's your YouTube? Uh, it's, it's on the side there. Just okay. take a photo. Yeah. I just like your smile, it's perfect. Don't ever lose that, don't ever lose it. Can I actually ask you yeah. a question? Yeah. How it's do you deal with Ligma? Ligma? Yeah, Ligma balls. Ligma balls, bitch! Damn! Wow, that's so cool. Wait, what I transited. Yeah. Anyways, 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 anyways. We're, actually, yeah, we're uh, in the middle of something. We're doing an interview. Yes. Yeah, so yes. I'm, I'm doing it. Uh, it's his channel though, bro. I know. Yeah. I'm also doing a social experiment where I, That's not I do social like, experiment. Yeah. Oh man. <laughs> I'm gonna have so much fun in post editing with your face. Instagram, yeah. Yeah, what's your Instagram? Uh, it's uh, I'm at I'm gay.com. Okay. So apparently, great job, Sean. Amazing. Yo,